Hi, my name is Tom Casey, and I wanted to do a quick uh, video today on your limousine company. The purpose of this video is really just to compare you, one of your competitors, um, in terms of where you guys fall out in search results when people are searching for limo service online in Jacksonville. But first, um, I'm just going to look at a couple of things I want to point out to you. Uh, areas of improvement that would really help you out. But first, I want to show you how many people are actually searching online. This is a Google tool. Um, that counts searches by month and it rounds them up. Um, anyway, this is what the last 12 months people were searching for limo service in the Jacksonville area. There's 210, 210, 170, 140, 140, this should be 210 again, um, 140, 210. So that's a lot of people searching uh, for limo service. So I thought that this would be a good exercise um, just to show you how you compare. So what I did is I went to um, Google and I did a query for uh, limo service in Jacksonville and this is page one and what I want to do is find somebody I want to use somebody on this page to compare you to. Oops, sorry about that. So I'm going to use East Coast Transportation and let's see where I find you in the search results, okay? Here you are, Bars Transportation, Black Car Service. And this is page three. So what I wanted to do is I wanted to just look at two factors, okay? Just two factors only because I want to keep this video short. But these are two factors that search engines do consider when they're ranking people in search results. So um, the first one I'm going to talk about is something called citations. A citation is a listing for your business in a directory site. What I mean by that, it's a name, address, phone number, listing for your business in a directory site. So this website I'm on right now actually goes out and counts um, right here, counts directory, and it finds directory sites and counts citations. So as an example, here's a directory site called AB Local. All right, so if Bars Limousine and Transportation had a listing on AB Local of name, address, and phone number, that's considered one citation. Okay. Now, search engines like citations because they feel like it makes you more legitimate and therefore want to rank you higher than someone who doesn't have as many citations. So, what I did here at the top of this webpage, you can actually go out and put businesses in here and it will count the number of citations they have. So, I put you here. It says you have 82 citations. That's pretty good, actually. Um, East Coast Transportation, who we're comparing ourselves to, has 172. So, you can see there is a difference, but um, the good news is that you can get added to these directory sites fairly quickly and fairly easily. So this 82 number, we can get that well into the hundreds um, in short order. And that would have a, a nice little impact, positive impact on where you show up in search results um, when folks are looking for limos. Um, it should result in more phone calls and more business. The second and last factor I'm going to talk about is something called backlinks. Now a backlink is a link from a, one website to your website. So as an example, say there was a website called um, JacksonvilleLimoSupplies.com and on that website they had a link for BarsTransportation.com and it went to your website, that's considered one backlink. Now search engines like backlinks even more than they like citations. Um, again, for similar reasons, they feel it makes you more legitimate and therefore they want to showcase you over someone who doesn't have as many backlinks. Now this website here um, actually goes out and counts backlinks for a site. And I put your site in here and it did a count and it tells me this is the number we want to look at unique. It tells me you have one unique active backlink. Okay. Let's look and see what East Coast Transportation has. This is ECT Jax. They have 44 unique active backlinks. So that's obviously a, a quite a bit of a difference. But the good news is you don't need 40 backlinks to, do, to improve. Um, probably could just do it with 10 or 15 quality links. What we want to do is get this guy up. This link influence score, that is an indicator of how strong the links are that are coming into your site. Basically, it's based on how strong the website is that's linking to you. The stronger that site, the higher the score is going to be. Um, this can go all the way to 100, but most people don't even get there. 20 to 30 percent would be fine. So that's what I'm saying. If we just added 10 or 15 good quality backlinks to your site, get the score up into the low 30s, that would have a nice big impact in terms of where you show up now. 
you show up a lot higher in search results you're going to get more attention more more phone calls more business so that's the end result <laughs> but anyway um, I just want to just cover these two factors but you can see that just, just between your company and this other company just with these two factors alone there is a definite difference but you also can see that there's steps that can be taken to mediate that difference and correct it and as a result help you out and where you show up in search results okay so I hope that was helpful um, this is what I do for a living but I don't charge for consulting so if you want more information about what I talked about today you want me to review other factors that I always look at for my other customers the impact search um, you know, results or even if you want me to review your website I do that all for free no cost no obligation all right so anyway um, that's it for today uh, have a great day bye now